I'm... I'm... What's happening to me? I think what the demon did to you is making you ill. This is too much. Let's try this with a different approach. Come with me. Maybe I can explain to you who we are. I know what you're going through. I went through it too. When, when I was approached, I thought all these people were crazy. <laughs> I still think they're crazy. <laughs> Especially Sean. I mean, all this talk about angels and demons just, <laughs> just made me laugh. But when I really listened, I knew there was something to it. I knew there was something different about me. And I fit in here. I like it here. We were chosen by God to protect the world from the even that the devil let loose. I can create illusions. Anything I want people to see, it can happen. My name's Crystal. I don't know what my power is yet. You're gonna like it here. Just give it time. I know you think of your powers as a curse, but the end will result in beauty. Wow. It's beautiful. Hopefully at least she can talk some sense into her. But this, this is all still new to her. She'll come around. She's just frightened. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'll stick around. But only until I feel better. I'm not totally convinced I'm sane yet. You feel better now? Yeah, I'm okay. That's great. And you know, if you need anything, I'll be here for you. <clears throat> well, now, now that we've composed ourselves, um, we need to find out what, what that demon was up to. Did you guys see which way he went? No, he was gone by the time we got there. I may be able to locate him telepathically, but first I need to feel his presence. Crystal, may I probe your mind for answers? Will it hurt? Only if you resist my psychic shock. There's another presence in there. What do you, what do you mean, like a possession? No more like something is attached to her soul. I've never felt anything like it. Like a demon? What's gonna happen to me? I, am I gonna die? Calm down, you're not gonna die. Uh, my guess is we find this demon, we find some answers. Come on, Alicia, let's track this now. Well, I'm coming with you guys. No, no, you're not mentally stable enough yet. No, if, if coming with you to find this thing helps me get better, I'm going. Killing this thing may strip the evil out of you. You're always going to be like us. Mr. Shadow, it's done! wounded an angel 
and injected her with the dark spirit. <laughs> Excellent. You've done well, my son. Soon the doctors will grow inside of her, and she will create a bloodline of half-breeds that will allow us access to many places that we cannot enter. <laughs> Victory will be mine! that detects when sources of evil are near, like uh, zombies, demons, vampires. Vampires? There's vampires around here? Yeah, but they're the least of our problems. We are never gonna find this thing if you don't stop talking. He's just dressed out. Hey Sean, it's over here. Yes, Mr. Shadow. Victory will be ours. I will not celebrate that victory just yet. As you have visitors. That's him. Inside you won't go away. It's too late for you. Shut up. tried to perform an exorcism while you were asleep. It's as if the darkness can't leave. As if your body is trapping it inside willingly. Why would my body do that? I'm not sure. Another thing is when I tried to pull out the darkness earlier, I felt the evil, I felt the presence of another spirit in there. Are you kidding? What, like a, de a demon? No. I think it's mine. It seems you have more than just the power of super strength. Your body seems to trap those that come in contact with your spirit. I think you absorbed some of mine when I read your mind earlier. Oh, that would explain how you knocked him about like a rag doll. <laughs> uh, right. Now I'm on the way to being a schizo. Don't worry. I'm working on a device that may be able to pull the spirits from out of your body. Though I can't say for certain when it'll be ready, but I'm working on it. Getting close. Look, we're just glad you're okay. And as you know, now our future holds us in great danger.
Only Shadow knows what your future holds. <laughs>